and welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for some action Nami, our fourth action deck. Uh, this one's going to be pretty cool. We're combining action with, you know, Bilgewater with Nami, where Nami wants to have you cast a lot of spells. Nami can grow your other units and growing a card like action could be really, really nice, you know, getting it buffed up so it doesn't die very easily so you can uh, stay out and, and do more striking and all that kind of stuff. The other thing that's really cool with this is we're going to be playing um, Lucky Finds. And I think the Lucky Finds could be really cool with Nami. You know, like we're going to have the Paydays, Profiteers, Bruisers. They're going to be making those Lucky Finds. And each one of those Lucky Finds will be, you know, if we have a leveled up Nami, you know, you're granting your weakest ally plus two, plus one with that. Or, you know, even with like Payday, each one, you know, like Payday is a plus two, plus one. And then the Lucky Finds a plus two, plus one. Like that's pretty cool. So, um, so yeah, so that, that's kind of what we have here. And so I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, we're going to try um, to have a couple siphoning strikes in here also. Um, we have one Unraveled Earth, basically, because y'all know, like, with Nami, you really want to, like, save your spell mana the first two rounds and then play a double trouble round three so you can save three spell mana again around, you know, the end of round three. Um, Unraveled Earth can just give us another three mana card to play to save our spell mana. Um, and then we just got, you know, a whole bunch of spells and everything like that. So let's go and give it a try. Let's play some action Nami. We're going to go play our five games in ranked. Trundle Trindamia. All right. Double trouble. Awesome. I like hourglass to save champions. Now we need champions. Notice from editing these videos yesterday that we're going to turn down the music volume on this board some. The music volume is pretty loud on this board. I like this one, though. This one looks really cool. Like this version, there's the four different versions of the Sentinel board. Seeker Conservatory. That's a nice one to have. Alright, we'll get this Warlord's Palace started. Never found a champion. Wasting four damage there. I could see them like wanting to do Catalyst of Aeons. I think that's kind of like what they they're planning on. Kind of guessing there. But yeah, this is not a very good hand for this matchup. I guess we double trouble again. Yeah. Not so bad. Uh. I mean, I guess those, those quicksands could help like later on whenever they're having like overwhelmed trundles and trindomirs, but at that point of the game, we're going to be already lost most likely. We just won our champions. Hopefully we get an awesome spell from the Mage Seer Conservator. Eh. Draw one card. Like that's for a, <laughs> that's all we get. I guess. We look after our own. Yep, there's the catalyst. I guess they did just kind of draw that. I think that's what they wanted to play before.
So they want me to play something bigger and then they ice pillar it. They don't want to just ice pillar a 2 3, I guess. Shelly. Wonder how much this is worth. So it's possible we get spell shield. Finally found a champion. So I can play Nami right now, but I kind of want to play the Siphoning Strike instead. So I think we're going to do that. And just kill... I mean, it's just killing the Ice Pillar. Oh, well, we're going to do that and, and grow. You know, like, while it's safe right now. Okay, so that was not the worst turn. Hey Flash, uh, actually I didn't qualify for the season for seasonals, unfortunately. I didn't get to play in it. Uh, obviously I wanted to, um, but the Thursday, the last day, um, I was I played ranked in that day and did very poorly and lost LP and therefore did not qualify. It was a frustrating day. You know, if I, if I couldn't do well that day, that means I probably wasn't going to do well in the tournament, I guess. I suppose you could look at it like that. That's a sea biscuit, Shelly, but good try. Follow my blade. So I think we're gonna be going with our double quicksand. take any overwhelm damage. Spell shield? No spell shield. That's ruination we lose. But, you know, it's just the ge Okay, it's just the game that we have to kind of play. Yeah, I've heard the seasonal was a was a mess with the with some delays and some bugs and things like that. But no, unfortunately I didn't get to play it. Okay, come on, spell shield. Really kill them anyway. Let's 
Spell shield. No spell shield. Really need spell shield. Of course, they could have had something to bust up spell shield too. Good game. So it was just no champion for too long. And they had a good hand, they had good removal. I think that's going to be a tough matchup for us. Like, that just. That's a tough matchup. Feel the Rush is a heck of a card. There. Yeah, and, and we had the Spell Shield luck let us down, too. Oh, come on. We have to face this matchup again? This is not a good matchup. Uh, this is not a good matchup. Um, I guess we're going to keep Shelly. Hey, Viego's Music Box. I'm doing good. All right, well, we have a champion a little earlier, but yeah, this is this is not the matchup we want to face. Good people don't look the other way. Nothing escapes my watch. That's too bad. In Avarosa's name. Avatar attack? Oh, the, the Avatar card? No, we don't we don't have that card in this deck. We gotta get, you know, tough or plus one, plus one. Plus one, plus one. Look at it sparkle. Cool. In and out. Um, I guess if I play Vagabond. Cool, I bet. We're very close to leveling this up now, and, and you know, all we need is just a pump spell to level it up. You cannot run from absolution. Okay. Um, we're attacking for nine. I'm thinking about getting the five two and attack, you know, attacking with the five two also. So that'd be uh, fourteen. Tough choice. Their deck just does so good at healing their nexus. Oh sure, take your time. I love to be kept waiting. I don't know. I'm not gonna do that, but maybe I'm supposed to. Man, I love Sprayfin, though, also. I love Hourglass and Sprayfin. I like both of these cards a lot. You know, Hourglass, obviously, protecting action. What was theirs is I'm going to take ours. the Hourglass. This is justice. That's really nice. No healing for them. No one ones for them. And now this stays at two health. Yeah, I was hoping they would just like play a trundle right here, and then we would be able to siphoning strike. That's what I was hoping. 
I don't know if... Uh, this is just the coral creatures. I'm letting them avalanche, though, which is kind of a problem. Payday, you would have been gr great before. My blade grows restless. Hmm. I mean, I can kill that with the siphoning strike, but then they get the 9 9. You know, but we can root this predator, siphoning strike, they get a 9 9, I get the draw 2. Man, they're back at 20. Man, this is a rough matchup. This is a rough matchup. Especially if you don't have Nami right away. One drops goes, those are good. Man, we are so bad at finding champions. We have the one action. Not really seeing anything good. Those are not good. I'm gonna do it. That's a tough matchup. Can we please play against something else? Yay, not feel the rush. We can actually play a real game. We have no chance against feel the rush. Alright, so very good hand to uh, Mulligan. I think we'll actually keep this on Ravel to Earth, because that's a good round three play. I'm not I'm expecting them to be kinda slow. And you know, like for leveling up Nami. Man, it'd be really nice to find a Nami though, one of these games. I like the hourglasses to, that will protect Nami. But we still have to have Nami. Okay, so now we have double trouble. 
Let's do one of those. I think I actually want to do Unravel the Earth. Gives me another draw towards Nami. Because that was not it. Yeah, how do, yeah, how do whenever we play against Zoe Nami, they always have Nami. Yeah. 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 Alright, so we will go ahead and double trouble. So we can, you know, use spell mana. So now whenever we attune attune, Nami is leveled up. best just to get this challenge in real quick before they play another multi region unit love the energy embrace the current or be swept away I will find the moonstone I will save my people I want to get this Warlord's Palace started. Maybe I should have played that Double Trouble, because now it's hard to play Spray Finn. Alternatively, I can just attack with everything. They get one block. They can kill one thing. I don't really care. Go away. I'm gonna kill that. It's got fearsome. Choo Choo with that resub. Thank you, Choo Choo. 15 months. <laughs> That's more than double seven months. Thank you so much for that continued support, Choo Choo. I really appreciate that. Alright, not going to be easy to take down Heimer. We're not taking it. We're taking it back. I guess so. Baddies beware, Mama's got a gun. Safety disengage. Hmm. Interesting. Oh man, they're also a mini morph deck. Why do I have to think of the card mini morph? That makes me sad. Yeah, but I mean, they're going to have a lot of, like, interaction and everything, as far as, like, I, yeah, we could try to do, like, 17 damage, but we could get really blown out by just, like, wasting a whole bunch of cards. Also, I don't like any, any play. I don't see a play I like. I do like drawing action. That was good. That was a good play. Um, 
I'm glad we still have all this stuff now for after action. And they're just, you know, replacing stuff over there. Uh, do I want ebb or payday? Or neither? Ebb is three spells, but like... I guess it's two targets, also, and three spells. Righteously My lowest cost card. We need card draw. I don't think we have any, but like that's all we need. Is card draw. Uh, thank you for giving me something to heal, I guess. Hoping we hit the commando, of course. We had the Shelly in play from before. Yep, there's many more. What's the motive? So Mini Morph gives them another elusive, but I have quicksand. So that levels up Heimer. I'm like, how is Heimer not leveled up yet? So if I do that, we grow Shelly. Now let's just do this and... one over there. We just need card draw. Like, what do we have that draws cards? Do we just need more cards? Do we have anything that draws cards? Unraveled Earth? Alright, so we want to ebb right now. Oh, hit, hit one of these elusives. No, 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 I... I tried to pull that back, because, because you know, with the Warlord's Horde, I didn't want to actually do that. Whoops, I tried to pull that back. That's my bad. Yeah, because now we should have the Warlord's Horde. Should, should have popped already. Okay, a second one is not okay. The first one was okay, the second one's not okay. Uh, second one, not okay. Yeah, I needed Oh sure, I take your time. That. I love to be kept waiting.
You're going to cost two, so I'm going to have two other mana. I'm thinking I'm taking... Gosh, it looks like I'm going to be taking exact lethal. I'm counting that I'm taking 19. I guess I have to waste this Absolver. I guess I have to waste the Absolver. Okay, they didn't attack with that thing, so... How is this working? Why is this so difficult? Is what I mean. oh, that's exactly lethal. Dang it, I... I could have figured this out somehow. I guess we had to use the ebb. Use the ebb. No giving up, no matter what. That was a very difficult. Yeah, that was a very difficult game to stay alive. Okay, so it was the payday that I couldn't play. Use ebb and flow. That was tough. Because, like, the whole time I'm thinking that they're also going to be attacking with everything, so, like, what am I doing against that? It was really, like, the main thing was that I, I accidentally targeted my Nexus to heal, right? Like, that one time, like, th that would have made a big difference if we would have had that uh, pop earlier also. But we didn't. Okay, so we need a lot of spell mana still. Crooks to kill. You know how it is. Of course, would like to have that card after Nami, because it's two spells. But we need to, like, cast spells right now to get rid of spell mana so that we can gain more spell mana. Also, we're in a little bit of a rough spot. As far as that's concerned. We need a good three mana spell. That's not good. I want to play this first so we get at least get like the plus one plus zero buff. What's the other thing? Tough? play this for a blocker from an open attack.
Kind of like just grab a sandstone charger to block. No, we're going to predict draw. Okay, this ebb flow could be pretty nice taking down some stuff. Like, if we're really lucky, we hit the 4 2 quick attack. Cool, cool. Okay, so a 5 2 quick attack would have been better to hit, but we'll take that. Seven. Let the tide carry you. Rise with the surf. <laughs> All right, not not the best thing to hit. Challenger or Overwhelm? That's difficult. You know, Challenger, we can try to take down Tristana. But Overwhelm, we're putting a lot of pressure on them. I kind of think Overwhelm. Hey, we got some resubs coming in here. Thank you, Jack. Thank you, Kitty. Dexterity. Thank you so much. We're going for lethal. All right, we got there. Gotta win. Let's go. My loved ones will be safe a while longer. Good win. Oh, Leeson. All right, maybe they don't draw Leeson. That's always a game plan, right? Have them not draw Leeson. Just keep it in spray thin, cause spray thin awesome. So I could see them having Twin Disciplines and going plus three, plus zero. So then that's a four, three. So if I, you know, if I block Shape Stone, we trade. I think that's what they want. one right now. Jailbreak means we go to four. They're going to have triple eye of the dragon. Ridiculous. What a hand. This naturally had two Eye of the Dragons and that gifts from beyond for a third.
Alright, took one of them out. I think I just pass. So we level up Nami. We don't get the extra spell mana here. The Mirai will never know fear That's how it is. My quest is dangerous, but I will see it through. Now we see that third one. Uh, I guess fearsome. I wanted, you know, like spell shield. Because I don't want. Because hush is a problem, right? Like if I attack with this action, they go hush. That can be a big time problem. I think I just skip. It's either double trouble or skip. I think we just skip. Well, hope they don't have hush. If they do have a hush, it's still a 3-3. Three, three. Nice stun. It's their first spell. So they'd probably use Pump Spell, kill Nami, but we do have a backup Nami. I don't I don't like that we hit the Scrappy Bomb, because that Scrappy Bomb takes up spots. I wanted to, you know, maybe Vagabond. Double Trouble, not a good draw. Huh. That's surprising that they... Had that and didn't just do that the first time. Hmm. I mean, it's it's possible I could hit Lee to stop a barrier, but not like. Guaranteed and or likely. Please hurry. My people can't wait much longer. But it's possible. Let the tide carry you. Maybe I'll let them off the hook. Maybe I should have Nami challenge. So their one threes have to like block the six two also. We're not taking it. We're taking it back. I don't want it. Yeah, I didn't want them to be able to have their three-two block my action. I'm gonna try to force a lead block. That's what I was going for. Our enemies cannot hide. So that's 14. It is time. He sent such a fun card. Such a fun card. We'll just have to keep trying. So really disappointing games here with our action Nami deck to start the day off. You know, feel the rush and Lee Sin. Those are, you know, those things are just are really hard to stop and we just don't have the kind of interaction in these regions that can hold on to, you know, that can beat 
Field the Rush or Lee Sin. You know, like we don't have them anymore for anything like that. Like the best that we have is the Quicksand. But that's that's kind of about it. And so we saw that we just didn't have the interaction that we needed. Um, so like the Ruthless Predators were actually pretty good. I, I kind of think that maybe we need more of that kind of stuff. More spells that give vulnerable that help stuff out. Like maybe maybe that's what we kind of need. And the good thing about um, Ruthless Predator is that it gave us a target on our own thing to help the countdown for the Warlord's Palace. Um, but maybe we need that. Maybe we need like, I don't know, Shakedown. Or ex the problem with like exhaust and the list, that kind of stuff, is you're just giving your opponent's thing vulnerable. Uh, there's the other Bilgewater one that's one mana. You've been warned, all that kind of stuff. You're only giving them vulnerable, so you're not getting a, a countdown uh, with your stuff. But that's what we kind of saw is that we would we would like you know make some random followers, but then we couldn't really get through. Um, small blockers, you know, if they have like spiderlings or, you know, random two ones and stuff, we couldn't really get through those uh, very well. And then they would have your Lee Sin or your Feel the Rush type stuff and they would kill us. So I could see like more ways to grant to over, to give Overwhelm, to maybe to get through. Uh, I think, you know, maybe we could get rid of like Jailbreak. That card didn't seem to matter. Coral Creatures didn't seem to matter. I think we could probably get rid of like Jailbreak, Coral Creatures, those kind of things and play you know maybe another unraveled earth or two because that's like that's actually a card like on three man that we can play uh to help that out and then you know maybe some more give vulnerable for removal could also use more card draw right like we didn't have enough cards ever it's, i don't know maybe that's ruinous path maybe that's preservarium but preservarium of course isn't a uh, spell and then it also takes unit mana and you really want to use spell mana um, so maybe, maybe we're just talking about playing, like, I guess at that point, maybe we just have, like, Salvage. I don't know. Need a little bit of work, but there's obviously power between, um, Profit, or sorry, sorry, <laughs> between Nami and Auction. When you have your champions, they're obviously very powerful together. It's just, like, how do we really maximize them? What do we do there? Um, you know, those, those are the kind of questions we still have and like, how do we finish games? How do we win games? Those are the questions that we have to answer. All right, but that's going to be it for action NAMI. So those y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And as always, feel free to leave those comments and yeah, so the really unlucky spread of games. Yeah, they, we did not have the best luck. That's for sure. Our opponents, uh, yeah, like they, yeah, they, they were doing great. They had, whether is uh, yeah because we had double catastrophe right yeah so like we lose to feel the rush double catastrophe and lease in those are the only three things that we lost to and those things are just so hard to stop right like two 30 30 overwhelms or two you know 10 10 10 overwhelms that get even bigger and then lease in with overwhelm and you know lease in hits for 15 overwhelm by itself or 14 overwhelm like like how do we yeah <laughs> so if it's not for like you know, 10 plus power overwhelm, you know, I guess Lee Sin was the smallest thing with only 15. The other was like 20 overwhelm damage. The other one was like, like 60 overwhelm damage. If it's not that we were good, <laughs> you know, those that's, but that's just really, really hard to stop. Uh, lots of decks will lose, lose to those things. All right. But anyway, that's going to be it here for action Nami. So uh, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you for the next video.